All right, so split pogo is linear. You're gonna be doing split pogos forward for the prescribed distance and then backwards for the prescribed distance. As always on pogos, they're ankle jumps. So make sure that you have short ground contact time and you're pinging off the ground on each jump. Since these are split pogos, you will be switching feet, right? On each leg. And then while you're in the air, pull those toes up towards your shin so we can get that calf, those calf muscles on pre-stretch for a more forceful contraction. That's how you do split pogos linear.